Чувак, мы здесь. Пуль yourself together. We don't have long before nightfall, okay? Okay. With the tunnel collapse, the only way to reach the escalator down to the other station is cross the surface. And trust me, we don't want to be caught out here in the fucking dark. Опа, we're in luck, Artyomich! This place seems lived in. Rangers probably, I don't know. And when there are rangers? Shit! Short on filters. We'll have to make do. Now come on, take what you need. We're all brothers in the metro. Hey, Priyati. I could use a good watch like yours. Knowing how much air you got left is a must, huh? You know, I've heard of things roaming around that even bullets can stop. You have been through some bad shit, I know, but not like what's coming. Artyom, remember, if you want to live, don't drop your guard for an instant, okay? Whoa, that's impressive! I heard about this place. That plane was headed into Moscow when the whole city caught fire. Uh, the building where it crashed, that's the entrance to the theater. The ice is towing up here. It's almost like spring, huh, Artyomich? Maybe we'll live to see the summer. Wait, 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 wait. There's got to be an underground path somewhere around here. The rangers would never cross the square out in the open. Okay. We could walk down the wing here. Okay, so much for the sun. Those clouds moved in fast. Oh my god! Wait! Hey! Artyom, when was the last time you saw Raid? Ah, shit! Yeah, they do act. Gee, I almost feel it burning through my gloves. There's the crossing. Let's hurry there. Follow me! Check for filters, Artyom. You wanna swap your mask? Do it fast. This poor bastard won't be needed here. Yo, for a Ugh, yeah. Think I'm gonna be sick. Tread carefully. They say these tunnels shelter more than just mutants. A good communist doesn't believe in souls, Artyom. But this fucking place of death makes me, uh, wonder. Let's go out to the light. Check that service room. You okay, Chubak? You're all covered with blood. Found a shotgun? Nice. That will come in handy. Atom, stop! Get down, now! Watchman! Yo, my you a huge bag. The storm must be driving. Stay calm. They spot us. 
shreds. Ooh, I smell trouble. Shit, that was close. Okay, Artyom, no more tricks like that. Let's get to the plane before another pack comes through. Move it! Oh, I've heard stories about this place. Weird shit happened here. Hey, try opening it. I'll give cover. Jumped! Oh, bleh, let's try together. Moving. Look, Artyom, don't lose your head in here. You understand me? Okay, let's go. One ranger told me this was a flight from Mallorca. Family is returning from vacation, you know? You know, Artyom, I've never been to the sea. Or even on a plane, myself. Yeah, well... Wasn't meant to be. I feel... I don't know, I feel... Weird. Chuck, are you seeing this shit too? Artyom, what is this? Find the entrance behind the building. Shit, a demon! Watchmen, as soon as we moved away from the plane, and we were almost there, huh? Get ready! They're moving in from the second floor! Get 
Let's go to the theater and round the next corner. We have to move now. Follow me, faster, faster. Come over here. Go. Give me a hand. Faster. More are coming. We have you gonna find the entrance. right we're going up soon are there many watchmen around we were lucky to get here okay there's a nest in the building by direct plane yeah, I wonder if it's such a bad dream today oh you want a nightmare well it's waiting for you up there no sense going with just three men to clear a nest we need a couple squads at least so what now you're not going you can gather the men first oh, we're waiting for the guys on their way then we'll give the beast some hell. It's my height. The new standards say I'm two centimeters short. What happens when they find us here? Take it easy. No one's chasing you. Anyway, two centimeters isn't much. Not for you, maybe. You can join the army and be a citizen again. But your dependents get hanged! <laughs> Shit! I will join the army if you don't stop. Still waiting. We're giving our chief hell, but there's nothing he can do about it. So, maybe while they're talking, you could let us in? No, we can't. Sorry, that's forbidden, without a permit. How about just the kids? And leave the parent here? No, you better just wait here. How could this happen? We've been in the Reich all our lives, and now we're freaks? Ugh, this happens all the time. But why? Why to us? They keep raising the standards. Last time it was our neighbors. This time, it's us. Would be long before Führer has the station to himself. But what do we do now? Live! And be glad we won't have our skulls measured every day. Oh, I'm... I'm fainting. Hard to breathe. Calm down. Take a breath. The boss is busy now. Wait here, please. So, that's our plan. The station next to this one is Revolution Square. One of ours. Red. And Revolution is spitting distance to police. So, I, as a good communist, which I am, will vouch for you. They'll have to let you through, and you'll be home in no time. What do you think? Are you the one they just told us about? Yes, we are. Great. Come in, then. So, my Spartan friend, have a look around. There's plenty to see here, huh? I'll talk to my people and find you. Welcome, and have a good rest. But you do understand that we can't wait here forever. Bullets to the last surviving theatrical critique. 
Bullets for mercy on your souls. So, young men, I see you like my witty sign. There is a place for everyone in this underground. Murderers, whores, tyrants, money changers, and even peasants, for Christ's sake. All are welcome here. Even lousy actors. I live in a theater where we breathe the miasma of the decaying Bolshoi. This station is overpopulated with the ghosts of the opera. But is there a place here for the best critic of our once great country? Hell no. I tell the truth. And I am repaid with insults and poverty? I say you are a disgrace to the name of Bolshoi. And they reply, now Bolshoi is us and us alone. They're immune to criticism. They choose money over art. And these poor souls traveling from all over Metro to see the glorious Bolshoi? They are played for fools. They say that art only interests the well-fed. But my young friend, I will argue that even the hungry need art. For thinking on exalted matters dulls the pain of an empty stomach. But sadly, true art is 20 years gone. What remains is profane trash. And so my own hunger persists. Will you honor what we've lost by perhaps donating a bullet? Ah, so there are still men, not just marionettes. I disgust myself. Here we sit, with drinks and party lights, when all around us radiation, death, decay, and endless war. Death and decay. That's exactly why we need theater. A drink and a show warms your body and soul. Give that, yourselves and your loved ones the gift of door. happiness. Feast. In the time of glory. So, what was our guest arrive? A master with the scythe. Any minute now. So drink up. Cheers. Wow! That is a really appetizing smell you have here, Simeon. Is it something new? New? As if mushrooms with mushroom sauce? Hey! Keep your hands out of the pot, or you're getting smacked in the head. There are only so many tickets! Sorry. Katya. Sorry. Why? What happened? Vitya didn't make it. How? We were heading back. A demon appeared. We all hit the ground and shot at the demon until it fled. No one suffered the scratch. But Vitya didn't get up. His mask, it had cracked open on a brick. And you, you left him there to die. No, Katya, we tried to save him. But it was too late. No, Vitya. We buried him there. A good place. We put white be. stones on the grave. I can't believe it. What was your chance? Give yourselves and your loved My ones. My papa the is a stalker. <laughs> He'll get me one of those songs. <laughs> My dad is a pilot. Yeah, show something we know. <laughs> wow, that's a demon. So scary, just like the a real demon. thing. A demon. Look at it flapping his yeah. wings. It's attacking. No. Dad says it flaps its wings like this when taking off. And my dad saw lots of demons. We're right, Uncle Misha. This is a demon. So, Nikitish, when do we become mutant father? Have you got enough money to last a week? A week? Two days, maybe. Then my life is over. And it took so long to save up. Oh, well. Good events. At least I had some fun in the end. What? You give up already? Shit. We can still make it to stalkers, instead of mere aids. Look, I got money for three days. So drinks are on me. Now you're just being greedy. Well, good luck. You're always welcome.
affordable and serious firepower. Well, feel free to drop by. Ammo and gear for sale. Bullets exchange. Leather. Best leather goods. Original designs. Low prices. Shrooms. This is great stuff. The best you'll find. I don't know. It's prohibited. Maybe I'll just get a drink instead. You can drink anywhere. This is a theater. Anything goes. But hey, I won't twist your arm. Just don't come back in 10 minutes. Look, there is another twist there. If you don't buy this, he's shooting. We can go to the revolution now. They will let us in through the theater. Eh, uh, thanks, man. If not for you, I'd never get this sucker to buy. If you want some for yourself, Come back in the evening. I'm waiting for a new supply. Did you hear that? Oh, sure. Uh, Come in. Well, Stanislavski, you can watch the show if you like. I'll wait for you at the dressing room. Maestro, if you'd be so kind. The can can. No? Enjoy the show? Sorry, man. Time to move on, you patron of the art. Oh, Pavel Igorovich. So glad to see you. Where have you been? You don't like us anymore? Hello, no, что? I'm, I'm totally in love with you girls, but I've been busy with work. I'm, I'm very, very sorry. I'll come back soon. I promise. Yeah, ты сюда гугу. Жанна, let me use your powder. In your dreams, you have your own. Use that. It's no good. Why can't your boyfriend buy you something better? Her boyfriend is cheap, that's why. No, he's reliable and doesn't waste his money. In that case, you should just marry him. He won't propose. He's too cheap for that, too. Refugees again. More refugees. What's going on? What else? Another war. Looks like the fucking commies are going to fight the Reich again. Shit. Is war all they know? Instead of wasting ammo on each other, they could be wiping out the vermin. They don't give a shit about that. The Nosalis has butchered my father. Who cares? No one. So how are we supposed to live? Or raise our children? If the monsters don't kill them, other men will. This is what I'm saying. Why go on day after day? Why can't it just end? Anyways. I tell you, we should be going, but, uh, let's drink to the fact we are still alive, huh? It's on me, okay? Here you are, two of our specials from the old stock, been infusing it for half a year. Opa, that's great! So, let's drink, Artyom! Smooth stuff, huh? And this is a good place, but nah, home is the best, you know? You know, I've traveled all over the metro and people talk all kinds of shit about the red line. That it's awful there, 
there is no food, that we shoot comrades for nothing, and you can't even tell a joke without getting arrested. Wait, let's have another drink. Here goes, Artyom! Here it is. Wow. So, <clears throat> yes, our life is a bit strict. One party, one leader, one ideology, but we have order. And everything is shared. Food, medicine, fuel, shelter. No rich men, true. But no beggars either. Another drink. And now, to equality. Come on, Artyom. No, 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 no. Pay that now. Ooh, хорошо прошла. Ah, where was I? Ah, uh, yes. Yes, look, look at the far stations. They freaking eat each other. Sell their kitted slaves. It's like the Stone Age. Ready? Left to his own devices, a man becomes a beast, you know? Order, order, is all that matters. That's, that's our salvation. So you can believe whatever, but I am red. I am red until the day I die. I drink to order. Блин. Кого? Артём, кого? Bottoms up! Bottoms up! So, my friend, that's how it goes. Don't be mad, Artyom. Just doing my job to protect the red line. And you, Musketeer, are from the wrong side of the barricade. Private, take this comrade in. Yes, Major, sir. Yes, sir. It is private. That was so stupid of me. I bought that talk of friendship. The stupid musketeer saying, Just you wait. I will get even. I wonder though, why did Pavel go through the trouble of trapping me? Move it! Hey, stop that! Yeah. It's just being over enthusiastic, you know. Artyom, look, I think of you as my friend, really. But as a soldier, you understand that I had to follow my orders and bring you here, okay? Now you're under arrest, but perhaps it's not the end of the line for you. I hope. We, the people of the Red Line, have Good day, sir. Good day, sir. At ease, товарищ. So, you're doing good here? Are you not? Yes, sir. Comrade Moskvin is here, inspecting the troops. The Secretary General? Here? What about Comrade Korman? Yes, sir. Comrade General is here, too. Opa, it's my lucky day, huh? Okay, things are moving faster than we anticipated. Look, Artyom, you're a smart guy, so we understand there is no such thing as coincidence. You are here because we need you. information. So, my advice to you, my friend? Cooperate. Okay? But don't worry, I got your back. Because we are what? Musketeers! All for one, and one for all. But your comrades in the order, their motto is all for us. War is coming, my friend. That bunker you guys found, whoever controls it survives and fuck the rest of us. But we have been preparing for this. And I want you to join us, too. Good day, Comrade General! Comrade Morozov, I was beginning to think you had not survived your mission. I was captured, Comrade Corbett. This stranger here, uh, saved me. What a coincidence! Lesnitsky, you're one of the Spartan Rangers. Do you know this man? Yes, sir. His name is Artyom. Miller trusts him. They found the six together. He's also earned several commendations since officially enlisting with the Order. Well, I am overjoyed to meet you, Comrade Artyom. I think we both have something to offer. Take the... Comrade to the negotiation room. Young man, let's dispense with the evil doctor and probing and cutting the chase. Hmm? This telepathic mutant, the so-called Dark One, is of extreme scientific significance. 
Tell me all you know about it, and I will allow you to keep your life and your job with the Rangers. <laughs> but as my spy, an operative, just like those uh, musketeers, one for all, and all for... Secretary General Comrade Moskvin. Corbut, I need a moment. And what do we have here? Another enemy of the revolution? <laughs> Perfect. As you have always noted, Lunia must start learning how to improve his, uh, people skills. As a matter of fact, we were... Ah, put away your truth serums. I'll show you a more traditional Red Army method. Faster and more effective. You shit! Spill your guts now! Tell everything you know of these six! Huh? <laughs> oh, fuck! Still nothing, huh? Hey, <laughs> bitch! You talk, or I'll fry your balls in pig fat! Passwords, code names, operation protocols! What are you doing, Dad? This is called interrogation, Lonia. Interrogation. Business as usual. What? You never did that playing dolls? No! You little shit! There's no power without blood! There is! Your brother ruled peacefully, and they still love him! Get back here! You're a thug. God damn it! Butcher. All right. Use your drugs. Use hot pokers. Just get everything out of him and shoot the bastard. And then come to my office. We must talk. Come back here. You may be my oh, I must agree with Leon. Brutality is a crooked path to information. I believe in science. One injection, and you will tell us everything. I need you to go to Venice and take care of the locals who made the delivery. This will not be a cash payment. Understand? Completely, sir. And uh, what about the Dark One? The creature has been located. The details are in this envelope. You will pick up the animal right after you go to Venice. Don't disappoint me this time. I won't, Comrade General. I, uh, I won't. Fuck Corbett! Fuck my father! And Morozov! And the revolution and my own future! I'd rather be shot and end up like father, killing his own brother! Listen, if you get out of here, just, well, just live! Here! Get in there! This is the way to freedom! Believe me, I know. <laughs> I spent all my childhood hiding from my father in those vents! Sit down, Corbett. Let's talk. About the negotiations in Polis? Ah, so you already know. I am the head of intelligence, after all. Then why did you let the information leak? 
damned refugees. Polis, Hansa, and even the fucking Nazis already know about our plans. The rats will be exterminated, and war is inevitable anyway. Inevitable? I have my doubts. So does the Politburo. A doubtful man is a fearful man. How dare you! You're the head of state security, and you report to me! Yes, but now, when we are one step away from a unified Red Metro, you have no right to disrupt the plan. I have no right? I'm... Moscovin, when you asked me how to deal with your elder brother when he was still the Secretary General, I helped you. And after his tragic death, I bucked your takeover. So I suggest you take my advice again. This is unacceptable. It's very simple, Comrade Moskvin. We all stand together, arms linked against the wind. Or it's every man for himself. But, Corbett, is this whole fucking metro truly worth the blood we're going to spill? I have a way of doing it without spilling any blood. No blood, you say? All right. Go do your trick. I'll handle the Politburo. A frontal assault is hopeless. But if we go underground at the church, advance through the catacombs, then attack from the rear, we should encounter little or no resistance. Then we just have to do a sweep. Attention! Comrade General! Soldiers, you are trusted with an important mission. Each group has its task, and you have been told only what you need to know to succeed. But remember that this operation is top secret, and you must not be taken alive by the enemy. I hope that I am understood. Questions? Can we use radios after we capture the assigned ducts? Only in case of emergency, and on a scrambled frequency. If we're faced with strong enemy counterattacks, do we hold the positions or fall back? Hold them. Anyway, the enemy is unlikely to mount an effective counteroffensive. Comrade General, we have been issued a banner along with the other gear, but we were also made to remove all our markings. We will leave no trace of our operation. Only upon victory and receipt of the following signal will you raise your banner over the captured targets. Further questions? No, Comrade General. Good luck, then. Survey! The red light! Light! light. 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 